Welcome to Let's Play Forza Motorsport 4, Part 206. And we, we be swagging, yo, in this segment, because I'm driving the Swag Aris. Aw, oh, yeah. So. Sweet. And I'm just going to leave it stock. So uh, let's just get started with our next series, which is going to be the six-cylinder Fast and Fun. So we we'll add an extra cylinder to these motors. Oh, shit. And we're also in A-Class. I think this was, yeah, it was B-Class. Now we're in A-Class. So here's what everyone else is driving. So uh, let's just get started with this shit. There's our where we're going to be racing, so ah. This time I'm actually going to win. Mark my words. I see the strengths and weaknesses of my car now compared to Sasaki's NSX. So I know like when to make my moves. Or when I need to make my moves. It's just a matter of getting in the position to do that. So... Exit here. Fuck off of that Esposito. The fuck Moore just keeps dropping back. Every fucking attempt at this, Moore just drops all the way back. Oh shit. Hi, how you doing? What's up, Sasaki? That did not go as planned. Nothing about this is going as planned. I know I could set a minimum bit, and I did. That's why Q spammed it and, like, go on for centuries. Excuse me, uh, Yoshida. I have bigger fish to fry here. So I'm really bad at the top of the mountain going this way. I've, uh, learned. That's not good, because that's the end of the track. It doesn't help that they're able to just enter that final sweeper. Uh... Shit, uh... Yeah, they're able to enter that final sweeper. Fucking really, really, like, just late and deep. Like Del P. Ooh. HG grid. Aw, yeah. That's gonna be. That's gonna be, uh. Some good shit, Thunder. It's been a good shit. Can I actually, like, pass a Salki now? I keep putting myself in the exact same situation every fucking time here. Okay, pretty much have to make the pass here or I'm screwed. go. Okay, now I just have to defend it through the sweeper, which is going to be, uh, probably not that easy. Very early entry for me, just because I wanted to protect the bottom. Because I know how these guys go. Anyways, there we go. Did it. That took, like, what, five, six tries? Fucking hell. Alright. Muller finished seventh. Sucks to suck. Okay, that was a fucking... Ah. Let's hope the next races are not nearly as difficult. Okay, race two at the Top Gear Circuit. We're doing one of the reverse courses. It's either the East Loop or the Outer Loop. I don't fucking know. Looks like it's going to be the Outer Loop. I would also like to play through Grid sometime. And before, just... We have this fucking trio of LPs of Grid, me, Thunder, and Test Drive. 
I wonder who'll finish it first. <laughs> but I mean, I wonder who'll finish it last. <laughs> Test driving. I don't know what the hell that laugh was. It was like someone trying to imitate Beavis, but not even putting any effort into it. Just going. <laughs> Instead, <laughs> you know. Ooh, fucking rude, mate. Hey, the truth hurts. All right. Oh, we're gonna get some fucking super wall action at the end of this race. I can already tell just how early I had to break for Gambon. This is gonna be good. Also, I love how the TVRs have the counterclockwise uh, tack. Pretty great. I'm breaking way too soon. I really don't like doing these fucking loops around Top Gear because I just can't see where anything is. Especially in cockpit view. Because that means I'm even closer to the ground. Just everything is blind. Bitch, I don't have to do Hammerhead properly. So, screw your negative 10 out of 10. So, uh, since the last time I recorded, there's been a lot of, uh, new car games announced and stuff. Such as... God damn it. Uh, yes, God damn it. I can't wait for that game. No, uh, such as NASCAR Heat 2. No, not Dirt Daytona. An actual NASCAR Heat 2. And fucking... Uh... WRC 7. F1 2017. It's like, oh my god, so many car games help me. And... Fly across the line. <laughs> that never gets old. It really doesn't. Hey! My car is destroyed, alright. Fuck yeah. Uh... It's the one major redeeming thing about racing at the top of your track, backwards, is that. Anyways, on to race three. Alright, here we go. Race three, Sunset Peninsula, short. Three laps is due to shit. Something, something critical reference. <laughs> Hi. What's up, Esposito? How the fuck are you doing? I like how that damaged my transmission. Like, engine's fine. Transmission, however, it got an ouchie. Oh well. 24% ouchie, in fact. On by Sato. Hey, there we go. Alright, now, who's gonna get the major advantage down the straightaway here? Or the speedway? Well, I'm closing. Looks like it's gonna be me. Alright, so. I don't have to worry about uh, being at a disadvantage down the speedway at least. So that's good. YouTube. Joke's on you, the chat's not going to be shown on YouTube. Alright, what the hell are you two doing over here, Sasaki Moore? Need to settle this uh, difference here. You know, I don't want to go three wide in this situation. Well, 
I know I responded, but no one's gonna know who I responded to. Oh. Hey. The fuck is going on? Stupid shit. Also me driving the Swag Aris. Which is not stupid. Or shit. It's swagtastic. You know it saddened it a little bit. Oh my god, I'm sliding. I'm sliding so much. Holy shit, okay. That is not how you do that first turn. At all. Do not take pro tips from me, because I am not a pro. Anyways. You know what sucks? Being, like, just naturally a fucking giant asshole when you're trying to be a nice guy. I hate myself. Anyways. A pro at giving the blow. You fucking know it, mate. Suck for days. Alright, this was a pretty easy race. Since this car is actually fast in a straight line. <laughs> and I just fucking wrecked it. Because I don't care. It's the finish, whatever. I'm gonna be stupid. And Muller beats Saki. Nice. Okay, well, that was a nice little race three, so. Onward to number four. As I reach level 110. Oh shit. Okay, that one didn't count. So, um, yeah, that. The, we're starting with the chicane at Sedona. Guess what happened? Ram, bam, break my car, ma'am. Broken my car did become. Not the good kind of broken, you know, like Matt Hardy. The, uh. Can't function. What the hell is happening here? Suddenly I'm just passing everyone even before the chicane, okay. At least it made the chicane a lot easier, so I didn't have as many people to uh, potentially ram into. So that's good. Come on, car. You're crazy, but I know you have some grip in you. Show me the grip. Ah. I try sometimes. Yeah, sometimes. Not all the time. Not no shitty try hard. Anymore. Except, yes, I am. Go fly out through the chicanes. Nah, I'd rather live. Excuse me more. Just gonna power past you, I guess. Oh no. Oh god, sliding everywhere. Holy crap, okay, we made it. I have not tried NFS World Online, or Offline yet. One day I probably will, but, eh. Speaking of Offline mods, I wonder if the crew is going to get one since the Crew 2 is happening. Hmm. I hope so. Because, you know, I, I would like to continue playing that game. It's the only thing I don't like about, like, you know, always online games. It's like, hey, once you shut down the servers, the game is literally unplayable unless you have a mod team, you know, fix that. It was like, ugh. 
just, you know, some games have a temporary lifespan, and I don't like that. So I want to play it at any time I desire. Anyways, we're here at Sedona, so let's go to our finale. So, uh, through all these attempts here at Hockenheim, I sure have forgotten how to drive this car. I love when that happens, where I just completely, like, forget how anything works. And get progressively worse at everything. It's one of my greatest features as a gamer. And as a human. Okay, a little lucky here, because... Sasaki doesn't have a chance to just drive away immediately. Just gotta deal with Yoshi er, yeah, Yoshida. Actually clears the sasa sasa. Sa 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 sa. Oh hi, how you doing, Mr. R34 man? I would like to take the lead position from you. Preferably not in the way I did, but hey, oh, Sato's in the gravel. Nice. Careful, don't don't slide the car. Don't slide the very easy to slide car. No, that went well. Oh, Sasaki's back up to second. I'm going to have to deal with him for the next two laps. And I'll actually have to deal with him, because he's cool. He's a lot better at getting around this track in that MSX than I am in the Swag Aris. Especially in the stadium section. Just, oh my god. So, I'm just going to try to drive a little carefully here. Not have that happen much. Basically, I'm going to drive defensively. It might not be as fast, and you know, I'll have to deal with Sasaki more, but... Overall, it should help with my chances of actually staying in front of him. No idea what lines they're taking through here, I'm just kind of guessing. Okay, that went pretty well. Oh, we won't have to go here, Hockenheim. Yeah, hucker heck. Gap for now over Sasaki. I'm sure, that'll all go <clears throat> all go away here. He's not breaking late and going wide ever. So that's good. Yeah, actually did fairly well. Kept a consistent 100 foot gap on Sasaki. Sometimes slow and steady is the best way to go around that stadium section. Even though he was still faster than me overall on an overall lap, but hey, whatever, I still win, so suck it. Okay, so that race was probably worse than the Alps race. It took way too many tries. But I finally win. So yeah, um, this car a little bit more ridiculous than I remember it being in Forza 3. I mean, it was probably upgraded in Forza 3, I don't know. But that'll conclude the uh, six-cylinder series, so... Yeah, three powertrain races series to go. Stay tuned for the next one.